Hey everybody, it's Luke over at Galaxy Tech Review, and today I've got a product from 233621. Uh, these are their E610 active noise cancellation earbuds. Uh, you'll see a little box here that has the active noise cancellation. Uh, it is rechargeable via micro USB and lasts up to 25 hours. You can check these guys out on Amazon. I'll have a link in the description below where you guys can check them out. Uh, at the time of this video, they are $59. So go and check them out. Uh, I did a review on the uh, full headset from 233621 that also had active noise cancellation, and they were very well built and very nice. These are also um, very, very nice. Uh, they have a nice premium feel to them, and uh, the noise reduction, they say that it's up to 92% uh, ambient noise reduction, and you do notice a huge difference. Any background noise as far as fans uh, or anything like that in the background are, are dramatically cut when you activate this, and uh, what I was surprised with these guys is that uh, you don't really lose any uh, sound quality, like some active noise cancellation uh, devices, when you act actually activate it, you lose some uh, sound quality, and these guys were really good. Uh, on the back, you've got a QR code that'll take you to 233621. Uh, if you want to check them out, uh, you can go to www.23361.com. And uh, uh, we've got some of the uh, just overall stuff here. Again, high efficiency noise reduction. They have an, uh, e an ear environment INC technology that can eliminate low frequency background noises by up to 92% uh, and uh, helps to uh, block out that extra sound that you may get in the background. Uh, you know, if you ride the train or something like that, these guys are going to be awesome. They last up to 25 hours, fully charged. Uh, so let's bust into these guys and show you how they come packaged, show you what I liked about them. Um, okay, I'll get the box out of the way here. They kind of put this strip across. We'll remove that. I'll just kind of put that to the side here. We'll take these guys out of the package for you. Get this extra packaging out of the way. Okay. So what they give you is a, a carrying case for one, which is actually really cool. I like the fact they give you a nice carrying case. It's kind of just this neoprene zipper carrying case with the 233621 logo on it. Uh, and inside that, they give you a few other things. They give you an airline adapter. So if you're going to be riding on a plane, you've got that. Uh, they do give you a, mic a standard USB to micro USB cable here so that you can charge the uh, uh, active noise cancellation uh, box here that's got a rechargeable battery in it. Again, that will last up to 25 hours when it's fully charged. And they give you some extra ear tips in here as well. Uh, of different sizes. They actually give you some foam ear tips. If you really want to block the sound out, you can do that. Um, and then they give you some large and small with some mediums that are actually pre-installed on the headset itself. So you've got all of that there. I'm going to put these back in here, get them out of the way, show you the documentation really quickly so that you know what they give you and what they don't. This is kind of a, just a warranty card here. Uh, it is all in Chinese, so I'm not going to go through that too much. Uh, and then you've got a card that uh, basically is just a fold out here. Uh, it's in English on one side and Chinese on the other. Uh, again, the E16, uh, they, they call the E16, 10 silence lover intelligence noise cancellation uh, headphone uh, user manual here. So you've got uh, that 92% uh, that they claim, and I can't really rate that. Uh, I don't have a way of actually telling you that it is 92%, but I did note, notice a dramatic reduction in uh, background noise uh, in, in several different environments. Uh, you know, uh, riding in the car as a passenger is one of them. Uh, when I turn it on, you get none of that uh, noise from, uh, you know, the car ride or anything like that. So they're, they're very, very good at that. The battery life as well lasted uh, a very long time. Here are the specifications, and I'll leave these guys up real quick so you guys can check those out. 
uh, you know, you've got your THD, your sensitivity, you know, your uh, frequency response there uh, and all of that. So if you need that, it is the battery itself is a lithium, lithium polymer battery. It's 3.7 volts at 250 or 240 milliamps. So you've got that in there and it is rechargeable. So uh, you can look through this. Uh, you've got some inline controls for iPod, iPad, and iPhone. The uh, volume up and track buttons do work for Android. They do not, but the pause, play, and call answer button do for Android and for uh, iDevices. So you're not going to get that uh, uh, track forward and track reverse uh, or I'm sorry, the volume up and volume down, uh, not the tracker forward and tracker reverse, because that's also uh, uh, controlled by the middle button. So the middle button will definitely work uh, for Android devices and for iOS devices, uh, but those the volume up and volume down does not work on Android, uh, will work on iOS, just so you know. So you can't control the volume directly is basically what I'm saying on Android devices. You'll have to do that from the device. Uh, but you can pause and play tracks and answer phone calls uh, on all devices uh, with no problems whatsoever. So you'll want to hold on to this just in case, uh, just so that you uh, can refer to it if you need to. Uh, as far as the headset itself goes, you do have this inline box. It's going to have the 233621 logo on it. Uh, and then you're just going to want to turn this guy on. You'll see your green LED here. Uh, and that guy means that you are activated. You do have a micro USB uh, recharging slot here. You have a nice uh, gold plated uh, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack here. And then you've got a nice uh, cord. Uh, the cord itself kind of has like a, a matte finish to it. It's not like a braided cord. I kind of wish they would have done a braided cord on this, um, but that's okay. Uh, again, here is your inline mic uh, that works fine. I had no problems with phone calls. Uh, the middle button is for answering and pausing and playing. Uh, and you can forward and uh, tracks on all that right from the middle button by doing multiple presses. Your uh, up and down volume dedication buttons, again, those will only work on uh, iOS devices. They do not work on uh, Android, so you will have to just adjust your volume uh, manually on your Android device. Uh, the actual fitting of these is really, really nice. They fit into my particular ears uh, very well, and they're very comfortable. Uh, they do a great job at uh, blocking sound out just by the way these are. They're very ergonomic, and I do like these. Uh, overall, they did a great job on these guys. If you're looking for uh, an uh, noise cancellation, an active noise cancellation set of earbuds, uh, these guys are definitely something to look at. At $59 isn't a bad price for these. Uh, Bose has a set that's like $229. Now these probably are not going to block as much as the Bose do, obviously, but they definitely make a difference. Uh, even in a silent room with just like a computer fan going on, they totally block that out. Uh, they're great for car rides, uh, anything else that you can think of commuting and stuff like that, where you just want to block out the ambient noise. These guys do a really great job. So these uh, were the E610s from a 233621 uh, with active noise cancellation. If you guys have any questions or comments about these guys, please leave them in the comment section below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. This was Luke from Galaxy Tech Review. Remember to like and subscribe and I'll check you guys out on the next video.